Sometimes you look up into the night sky and see something amazing passing by, brighter and closer than any star, traveling our solar system from very far. A nucleus made from frozen gas, rock, and ice, tails streaming behind them that look so nice. What are these bright visitors in the sky? Where did they come from? How and why? And I just passed by in 2020. You would have seen me in the sky. Both my curved as tail and straight blue eye and tail were visible, making me look very mysterious and mystical. July of 2020, I reached perihelion. That is the closest that I got to your sun. A long period comet on my way back to outer space. It'll be thousands of years before I return to this place. I'm Comet Leonard, and I'm newly discovered. Only I know the secrets you have yet to uncover. Passing by Earth in December 2021, and then my path continues onward to the sun. I'm excited about my trip and want to put on a nice show. As I get closer, my brightness will continue to grow. I have a hyperbolic orbit. I'll only visit Earth one time, then back to deep space for the next adventure of mine. 67P Trivium of Gator Semenko. You'll find that I am incredibly special. I'm the first comet to have a spacecraft land on me. The Rosetta spacecraft mission got amazing pictures to see. I also have a feature that is very unique. I have a far ultraviolet aurora around me. And one image captured a small chunk of debris, a tiny friend nicknamed Trivium Moon orbiting me. by their orbit around the sun. The closest they get to the sun is called their perihelion. When comets move farther away from the sun, the farthest point from the sun is called the aphelion. They look like they have one tail, but really have two. A curved gray dust tail and a straight iron tail that's blue. Comet tails will always point away from the sun because of solar winds and pressure of radiation. Comets travelers way up high. Cosmic snow I'm shaped like a flattened sphere. My orbit around the sun takes me about six and a half years. Scientists collected the first samples of a comet's tail for me. NASA Stardust Pro brought it back to Earth to study. A comet growing, and I have an odd shape. Not round like a sphere, I'm shaped like a chicken leg. A Jupiter family comet, my orbit takes about 2,500 days, so I'll be back soon to astound and amaze. I'm Donati, the comet of 1858, known as one of the most beautiful comets seen to date. I was the first comet ever to be photographed to see, and I inspired artists to paint the glorious sight that was me. When I visited Earth, I stayed a very long while, shining brighter and brighter to show off my style. I'm a long period comet and won't be back soon, I fear. I won't be seen again on Earth for nearly 1,600 years. 21 more, so I won't comet. I'm misunderstood. Because I've formed around another star, I'm not from your neighborhood. An interstellar comet from beyond your solar system, that's me. My composition and origin are both a mystery. I'm Comet Temple Tuttle, and I've left a gift behind. Every November, you can see remnants of this tale of mine. The annual Leonid meter shower is my gift to you. Multitudes of shooting stars streaming across the sky. <laughs> The bright comet of 1729. I am remembered for my brightness and my size. I was one of the largest and brightest comets ever seen. But there are other thousand comets out there even bigger than me. A newly discovered comet, Bernard and Ellie Bernstein. On my way in towards Saturn, I'm massive in size. I'm one of the largest known comets discovered yet. From the Oort cloud, I'm an outer solar system comet. Comet.